thought I'd share with everybody how I'm using these doggy pee pads with the Forever Litter Tray to help with the cleanup. It's working quite well. I've changed my litter several times and have not had any residual mess as you can see. So this is not a brand new tray. It has not been significantly cleaned. And so what I'm, a, I'm doing is simply using a, uh, a fairly inexpensive pee pad. You can buy them in a pack on Amazon for fairly cheap. You can see I got a lot of them in here, so that's going to last me a lot of, a lot of uh, changes. And what I do is I put this in and I put pieces of tape uh, around the edges. So it fits in there fairly well. The blue portion uh, can be taped. And so I'm going to go around and I'm going to put pieces of tape, several, about three here on this side, a few on this end, and on here. I'm going to go ahead and do that now and I'll come back here in a second and show you what I did. It's only going to take about a minute. So I'm nearly done here. I'm just going to put one more piece of tape here on the edge. You can see what I'm doing is just right here in the middle. I'm just going to put that over so that when I go to clean it up, I can just go around the edges and pull up the tape. I'm just using uh, packing tape. Um, again, you know, it's a little bit, a little bit of money, but not a whole lot, and certainly makes the cleanup a whole lot easier. Um, so then I've gone around. I've put a piece of tape here in the corner, middle edge. And the main thing here is that we don't want to get um, this to to come up and get caught in the rake. Um, these little lips here. Remember that there's going to be litter in here, and yes, the cat can dig, um, but uh, I haven't had any issues as long as you're not, you know, as long as it's not coming up and moving off entirely, you should be okay. So um, at this point, I'm going to just fill up the litter like normal, and then um, in the second half of the video, in about a week or so, I'm going to change this out, and we'll see what the cleanup looks like. Thanks.